everybody. Uh, welcome to the world's greatest improv schools showcase for you of improvised plays. Today we are going to do two improvised plays for you and we hope you have a grand time. Uh, to get our first one started, we just need the name of a play that has never been performed before. A Strange Resemblance. And with that, A Strange Resemblance. set up people over and uh you know it's like here's how people lived in 1864 you know they have a little house and i don't know it's it's, it's it seems so accurate somehow yeah i mean the attention to details did you see the stitching there was like a satchel do you see the stat the satchel stitching oh yeah like look at look at detail in there like this is how they used to make things just going to like a specific person with a skill set and being like yeah. I want a satchel it's like nowadays if you want a satchel it's like you call somebody you got designers involved you got a you know manufacturing that wait, god wait, knows wait, how wait. ethical you're, it is you're calling somebody you're not just like googling satchel for sale well I, well, I mean, you said if you want a satchel made, I was thinking of this from the, you know, the entrepreneurial mindset. I'm sorry. You, you, you are so into bespoke stuff. Like you just, my God. Yeah, yeah. Everything with you is like, how can I get this done? Like myself. I don't want mass produced crap. You know, this satchel, whoever owned this satchel probably owned it their whole life. It's like, you know, a well-made pair of shoes, you know? Well-made pair of shoes is going to last you years. Or you can buy some, you know, cheap things made by a kid in questionable conditions that fall apart in a year. And then, you, you know, you drop another 200 bucks and start over. Start over. Yeah, you know, I'm thinking about, thinking about moving. Yeah, yeah. You're gonna go through with it. Yeah, I, I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. Um, that's uh, we'll get something in the vending machine. Oh wait, wait, wait! Another one's gonna fall. Just nudge it a little. I, I always feel weird kind of nudging it, you know, in case kind of not supposed to do that. Um, I know well, It's like we've, we've got four Twix now instead of two. We don't have to split them. All right. Well, I, you want one? Yeah, I want one. So what time they do like a, a show out on the back, like on the back field, right? They do like a reenactment thing. They come out and talk about their lives or. So I'll tell you why I'm thinking about moving. I just think with the way real estate prices are going right now, it's, I should, I should lock in my gains, move to a cheaper city, and and live off that money 
then I, I could cut down my hours and yeah. Why, why, why should I be working 55, 60 hours a week? Like some sort of automaton, huh? Yeah. We're not robots. Not robots. And you're, and you're going to, you're going to do that place in, uh, was it Western Nebraska? You're not going to believe this, but Cynthia moved there. So no, not going to do that. There, there's plenty of places that I could, I could move instead. But. 49 other states she could have moved to. She could have moved to Omaha. She picked the West end of the state. Dude, I think, is she doing this just to stay around you? No, she moved first, so. Hey, I think uh, well, they're yeah. doing some reenactments in the back. Why don't we? Yeah, that's yeah, you? yeah, yeah. The reenactment thing. Great. Yeah, why don't we? All right. Oh, hey! So funny running into you guys here. <laughs> Who would have thought you'd go to reenactment Sunday? <laughs> Cynthia, hi. Yeah, hi. I'm just you know back to tie up a few loose ends. Hey, Charlie. How you doing? Uh, I'm great. I'm great. You do seem. You seem uh, pretty, uh, pretty, pretty. Uh, uh, can can I offer you a, a Twix? That, an extra one fell, and the they are making vending crit. machine. And... We've got four. Great. I like the left ones. <laughs> Listen, I'm going, uh, I'll, I'll get some, uh, I, I'll check if they need tickets or something for this reenactment thing. I'll, I'll, I'll be right back. Hey. Hey. You look good. Thanks. I mean, it's the Nebraska air. It does a lot for you. Well, yeah, it's windy there. You look, you're like a 80s TV anchor with that hair. It's like, <laughs> I, you've been in a tunnel. <laughs> I know. Oh, I know. Nobody can. Uh, nobody can match. Nobody can match the luster of LA stylists. You know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, um, how is Charlie? I mean, how are you? But how is Charlie? Well, I'm great. Charlie is no. Charlie's wonderful. He's uh. You know, he's, he's been doing well, a lot of gains, a lot of gains in the market, in the gym, you know, wow. all the gains, he's right? So <laughs> um, I heard he was moving. Yeah, I mean, you'd have to talk to him about Can that, I think. I mean, I just, um, I, I know I screwed up and I just really want to, I really want to make it work with him, you know? Yeah, I know. It's... Did you... You moved there because he talked about it, right? I mean, I also... That night he was drunk. He, he sat there and he, he talked about how he was going to take his money. He was going to sink it into a, a wind farm in Nebraska and let the air... Like make a living for him. I mean, there is. You so know, much he said that. I do. But it's LA is an a extra fifteen dollars for the reenactment. My God, oh, you're shitting me. I, anyway, fifteen bucks. Got us what do they it. reenact? That's fine. It's fine. Eighteen sixty-four. It's fine. I got here tickets for each of you. Thanks. You know, I bet I could get a discount. I'm a smooth talker, I, I, right? Of all the people, you know how much, you know how much I pay for this? Do you know how much this wool usually is? A hundred dollars. Sixty-five dollars. Oh, a right, hundred dollars. Twenty-seven bucks. I mean, that's what I got it for. That's what I got it for. I got twenty-seven bucks. Twenty-seven bucks custom cardigan. You should have. You should have uh, negotiated my house <laughs> in Nebraska. Here. I'll give you. I'll give you my receipt. Maybe you can do yeah, something with the, it. Give me the receipt. We're not, you know, look, we're not paying fifteen bucks for some, you know, watch somebody churn butter. Okay. 
I'll be right back. Take, here, take three. Okay. You, you uh, join your new house. I, uh, you're going to have to speak up. Yeah. Uh, Sorry. <laughs> um, no, it's fine. I, uh, it's, it's, it's quiet. <laughs> Funnily enough. Uh, it's, it's a little too quiet, you know? Mm. You know, I want to move there. Yeah. I can't, I can't move there now. Yes, of course you can. There's that great investment. It's just, it's right down the street from my place. How can I move there now? There's like, it's a town of 8,000 people. We're going to see each other all the time. But is that such a bad thing? We were engaged. No, I messed up. I'm sorry. I just, I got scared. I think that's, that's fine. That is up to you. I'm just saying I had kind of planned out this entire move. And I mean, Omaha's not even, Omaha's within the vicinity. You know, I, I, I've set up how to, I even found a, a city that had kind of T1 lines running in so I could, you know, easily make all my trades and things like that. And yeah. not, I mean, I guess I can find someplace else, but like, why that place? Like, because I love you. So, so you move there in advance? Yes, because I will do whatever it takes to get you back. Okay. All right. Good news. Good news. Good news. Okay. It's still 15 bucks, but wait till you hear this. Wait till you hear this. We get to be in the show. <laughs> what what are we, we gonna do i'm look at how i'm dressed how am i gonna be in the show no they're they're gonna let you they're gonna let you borrow stuff you like that satchel that satchel's yours you get the satchel man we're gonna get to be in the show i want to turn I'm, butter i'm, I'm gonna go i'm gonna go try on something <laughs> you're gonna love oh my god this is gonna be so fun this is a, this is like a, an experience nobody gets this experience she, she told me she still loves me. What am I supposed to do with that? Well, are you surprised? How are you surprised? She moved to rural Midwest America because you drunkenly rambled about it one night. I thought that she heard that and thought it was a good idea and just beat me to the punch and was like, well, I'm going to be here now, and then I have to go find someplace else, which is what I am doing currently. This is why you two never work. You miss all the signs. You miss all the signs. She's going to tell you she loves you. She's going to move to Nebraska. You're going to miss the signs. You're going to get back into this, and then you're going to miss the signs like when she left you at the altar. Her bachelorette party went on for two and a half days. I, I just, I, I just want this to be over. Look at this bonnet. Oh, oh look at you. Oh. And you see that, you see the lace, you see the trim? Mm-hmm. It's perfect. You know, they don't have anything like this in Nebraska, so I'm glad I mean, I'm doing it. I'm going to go get my satchel. I'm going to get that satchel. You I look great. Thanks. Oh. You do too. Always bespoke. <laughs> I don't, you know, I don't, he's happy that I am here. It's messed up. Like, I mean, we'll make the best of the day, but I guess should should I just go? Should I? 
Should I sell my house? Should I just forget he exists? No, we're in the show now. <laughs> I mean, after that, you're on your own. But like, I like made a whole like I went out on a limb here. I just want to make things right. Look at this satchel. My God. Do you think it's too much if I put my tw extra Twix inside of it? Hey, man. Everyone hold up. Little chocolate's going to rinse right off that thing. That's, you know, well-cured leather. You're right. The stitching is really nice on this. It's perfect. Just like, uh, just like you. <laughs> Yay! That was awesome. Uh, thanks, guys. Our next show is up right now, um, and we just need a title. And it's getting in the chat. And oh, it's called Sweat Stains. <laughs> <laughs> oh no anxiety creeps up on me is this how it's supposed to feel tell me when it's over i got some place that i gotta be it won't leave my friends hey get out of your comfort zone it's a blessing in disguise Get out of what you call home Your name is written in the sky It might feel just like you're on your own But baby, it's another lie Remember you were me I try to, to work, 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 work But it doesn't work I try to say something but I love the cutlery here I just, I mean, look at how Look at all the, like, the detail that they put into it Who knew that they even made forks this nice, really? Mm, I'm just, I'm, everything about it is just dream. I love it. Oh, God. Mm. Oh. You're so it, funny. And mm. I, it's, it's just got cream and just eggs and just eyes. It's, mm, I just can't get enough of it in my mouth at one time. You know, it's so funny. My One of my girlfriends, um, T Tina, she was actually thinking about opening up a dairy farm. And I told her, I was like, Tina, that's a really ambitious project, you know, but she really is committed to farm fresh eggs. And now, now I see why, you know, these are incredible. You know, I'm, I really like, I really like dancing. Um, it's what, it's what, it's, it's one of my favorite things. Um, I just, I love to I love to eat a lot and I love to I love to work out a lot and then I just love to I love to dance as much as I can and uh, and I'll be drinking a lot while I'm doing that as well and then I just feel like I get to the end of the night and I've been dancing and I've been drinking and I've been eating and I've just got this sweat on me you know and it's just pouring off my head and then I just feel fantastic. Yeah, that's right. You know, my my friend I was telling you about Tina, the one with the dairy farm, like she honestly, she used to always make drag me out onto the dance floor, but she'd say, you know, uh, Lindsay, you're such a beautiful dancer. She said, I, you know, and I don't I don't consider I don't want to compliment myself too much, but I, I do I do hear from time to time that I'm very limber. And oh my gosh, you should see Tina though. I mean, she can just turn and turn and turn circles around even me, but I mean I do, I do keep a beat. Um, certainly keep a great beat. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You, mm, this wine, this wine, by the way, ah, oh, I love it. Like I, you can tell that there's like it's from a volcanic terroir. I, th you know, I mean that would be my assumption. There's just like such minerality. You really have great taste. Oh, thanks. Uh, I mean, I, if I'm being honest, I, I just pick the, uh, I just pick the third thing on the menu. That's my normal strategy for this kind of thing. Just. The third one down but i'm i'm really pleased you like it um and may i say your hair is looking wonderful this evening yeah you're so you're so sweet i i'll tell you i well first of all oh uh, i don't mean to interrupt but how are you guys doing you having a good evening is there anything i can get you i i just i want i want more cream and more eggs please um and um tina uh, Tina, I haven't seen you for a few years, but yeah, I had no idea you worked here. 
Hi. I, Tina, I, we were talking about that dairy farm just the other day over email. I thought, <laughs> yeah, it didn't. Um, well, I mean, we should probably talk about that another time. I don't want to ruin okay. um, your thing. So, so odd. Fine seeing you here. I mean, I mentioned I was coming to this restaurant. It's yeah. I, well, yeah, it's, it's good to see you too. It's, um, it's really good to see you. How, how are things with you? Are you doing good or? I'm doing really well. This is, I'm on, I'm on, this is, this is Roger. I, I told this you is, about him. I'm Roger. Hi. Uh, I'm, I'm just, I, I'll tell you what, I've been eating so much. I just need to go to the bathroom. Um, I'll be, I'll, I'll be back in a minute. Okay. Uh, lovely to meet you, Tina. Really, really lovely to meet you. Good to meet you, Roger. I told you I was going to, you'd never even mentioned you worked here. You said you were working on some dairy farm and. I feel, I, yeah, I'm, oh my God, I'm sorry. Oh. I feel really weird about it. And I, I just, mean, you know, the state, the state is like, this guy is the one I was telling you about. Like he's, he's loaded. He has a lot of money. Oh my gosh, yes, like, enough to just, like, turn my life around, and it's, like, the biggest date of my life, and now I've got my girlfriend just, just like, waiting on it. I didn't even, it's, what it's happened to It's my assigned other? table, I couldn't help it. Like, I couldn't help it. They were, like, not willing to switch with me, and so okay. I had to, and I'm really sorry. I don't oh, know. No, I'm sorry, Tina. I didn't mean to. I'm so selfish sometimes, you know, can I tell you, I was just talking about you and how you're such a great dancer and, oh, like how you could just turn circles around me back when we were younger. And I, I'm just nervous. I'm just nervous. I'm, I'm like, I'm just trying to keep cool and I'm having a hard time with it. No, I get it. I get it. I don't, I, I wish that they would switch tables with me. I didn't want to make things weird. Do you like, do you want more wine? I think I could probably get it like, like on the house or something. <sighs> That would be that would be great. The stuff I really, I, it, I mean, it's a little for. Oh, all right, all right, uh, Tina, Tina, uh, uh, Elisa tells me you're a you're a, a wonderful dancer. Um, I, we're 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 planning to hit um, planning to hit the prairie later on. Oh, yeah. um, I sorry, I didn't tell you about that. I just thought it'd be fun. You know, it's it's I usually like the, the place where I dance till I sweat so much. You know, it's it's, it's really good. So Tina, you'd be more than welcome to come along um, and uh, have a few turns on the dance floor. Oh, that'd be really um, great. But you know, I I gotta stay late tonight and then you know roll silverware and all that stuff. So why don't I? I'm gonna run. I'm no. gonna get you a couple more napkins. It looks like you got a little stuff on your shirt. It's so good to meet you. Okay. Oh, Work smarter, not harder. Yeah. Roger, you're you're so sweet to think to invite my friend Tina, but I'm sure she's busy. I mean, she's got, you know, um, her dairy farm that I, you know, I don't know what the status is on that. Can I tell you something? I um, I actually um, recently started uh, tasting wines, um, like uh, with the aim of getting my sommelier certificate, which um, oh. is very interesting. That 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 is that is very interesting. That is that is that is very interesting. It's very interesting. I, it, well, I mean, you can you can tell you what you can pick the next wine uh, if you're in practicing for that. That's I'd love to see your wine choosing skills in action. Because Absolutely. you know you you never can over over uh, overlook the importance of somebody who's very skillful. I mean, what if you're at a fancy dinner and you need somebody to pick like a very sophisticated wine? Maybe it's with the client. I mean, it's a real. It's an asset, um, a very big yeah. asset. Yeah. Oh, excuse me. Mm. Um, or, yeah. Wow, these forks. I can't get over them, honestly. They're so cute. Uh, so cute. Mm. I might go to the restroom really quickly. I'm so sorry. I'll, I'll be right back. Oh, okay. I'm just bringing back the napkins. Uh, yeah. Roger? Excuse or, me. You okay? Sorry. <laughs> it's, it's all those... Um, all, all that, all that cream and eggs is uh, sort of comes back on you a bit. You know what I mean? I have to, I have to watch myself on that. Yeah, Tina, if you if you're at the prairie later, I know you said you had to, you know, work and everything. But if you're on the prairie later, you might have to sort of look out for me just in case I, um, you know, I start to sort of twitch down the left hand side or something like that when I'm on the dance floor. It's a, I don't my my normal doctor's not in town, so you know, it's normally I have him accompany me uh, when I'm out dancing. Okay, so um, 
is it like a dairy like thing? Like you have a, a thing that happens that are allergy or intolerance or something? No, no, no. I just, I, I just have heart issues, but I don't let them hold me back uh, in general. Um, I just, wow. you know, I, for, for me, it's all about consumption. It's all about more. And, uh, you know, if I see something, I want it. Uh, like like you for instance uh you're a love a lovely lovely looking woman and uh, i hear you're a nimble dancer as well um so that's you know that's something i like this is wild <laughs> oh hi oh, hi oh i feel so much fresher now sorry for that i just had to hit the pattern room really quickly can i just Whoa. say they have these adorable little soaps in there they're shaped like little ducks isn't this cute i just thought it was adorable i wanted to show you I no 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 take it we uh, we assume everybody's gonna take them oh so oh great there's this one in there <laughs> how fun how fun how fun cool so um did you guys decide on a wine oh i wanna i wanted to take a look take a look at the list because i was just explaining choosing a wine like is really like being able to choose like a really subtle nuanced bottle is such an asset and i'm definitely working hey, on cultivating hey, that hey sorry sorry it's my my business partner's just walked in i'm, oh. I'm just gonna i'm just gonna do a, a quick couple of tequila shots with him all right uh, i'll be i'll be right back oh, hey, to hey you right. animal oh gosh he's great gosh he's great he's um he just said he said what can I tell you also, I love the cutlery here. Like, I really think it's just cute. Did you choose this? Do you have any hand in no, choosing? No, I didn't. Before? I didn't have anything to do with that. And before he comes back, I need you to know that he tried to hit on me while you were Okay, and I, let me talk to you about this wine for just one second. Like, I'm thinking, I don't want to do too pricey, but I want to show that I'm sophisticated, like, and classy. So what do you think about this, um, this super Tuscan down here? Well, I think that he was hitting on me while you were gone. Okay, if you don't like Super Tuscans, you don't need to... to uh, like. Listen, I get it. If you want all the money, all the stuff, but that man has had egg running down his shirt this whole fucking time. I brought him extra napkins and he did, oh, I want to have sex with... Like, what the fuck? What the fuck? This is a step down, not this is, up. I, I, Tina... I will take I will take this um, Sasayaka. Thank you. That is a great bottle. Thank you so much for having it. It'll be perfect to complement the eggs and the cream. I now you may have cute taste in dairy farms and like great taste in soap or or, or forks, but I'm not going to hear you try and tell me something. This man who is literally my future, I am not going to hear you slander him. He's a wonderful man, and if I if I had to guess, you're probably after him for yourself. And I'm not going to let you play that game with me. Woo! Wow. Woo! I am fortified. Yes. That's so now cool. I am ready to go. That's so yeah. cool. Roger. Roger. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. You know what? Over at the bar, there's actually a huge tankard of beer with your name on it. It my, is. You just have to go over there and get it. My just actual name. What it's is my you actual actual your name on it. You are a special woman. You two are both very you special. Go, you go over there. You're both very special ladies to me. You really are. Yeah. Let's see you yeah. walking away with that little booty, Raj. We're gonna have a lovely time go later on. on. I'll tell you what, I've got I'll tell you what I got. I've got a private suite at the prairie, and it's gonna oh, be wow. it's gonna be epic, you know. <laughs> yeah, Did I mention nice. I ordered the Sasayaka? It is a wonderful wine, so sophisticated and a super <gasps> Tuscan. You guys are amazing, and I think you're gonna be great together. Super Tuscan. It, it just it, that reminds me of my my holidays with my dad. Um, that's that's really touched me. That's really touched me. It, it really means a lot to me that you're a woman that can get to my emotions as well as other things. That's, I just, I just I I'm really just gonna go do another shot with Pete before we go because this is great. Yes, Pete. Maybe maybe I don't need the Sasayaka. Maybe I mean I I I don't want to presume to to dictate what he drinks, but it does seem like if there's a tankard of beer and um, listen, listen, several listen, shots. Listen, 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 listen. I know we aren't like the super best friends of all time, but I really mm. care about you. I think you are a good human and you do not deserve this. That man is crazy. And I know wine, I know, but like, just, just so what do I deserve? Know. What do I deserve? What do I deserve? What could I deserve? Better do than I that, deserve oh my God. Security? 
Do I deserve to be able to be a, like a sommelier? Do I deserve to, to, to live a life of luxury and ease? Yes. Then what are you doing? What now? No, not that life of luxury. That's not a life of ease. You that might be always That's had your ease. head in the clouds, Tina, you with your dairy farms and your elaborate dance rich like routines. And it's like, come back down to earth for a moment with me here. Look at the silverware in this place. It is adorable. And I can never even eat at a place like this if it wasn't for somebody like Roger. Listen. I mean, maybe you're just not at a point where you can wait for it, and that's fine. I'm going to go to the bathroom. Looks I, I'm great, go Roger. Some more ducks. Getting ducks. sweaty. I got the beer on my head. I finished yeah. it, and I got the beer on my head because that's yeah. what my dad did. That's what my dad did, and that's what it's all about. Mm -hmm. That's what it's all about, do you see? Yeah. Oh, well, not too close. Dad. It's okay. <sighs> you're... God, I love those ducks. Right? They're so cute. I took five. <laughs> five ducks. Roger, try a sip of this wine. Um, it's actually, I think actually maybe it's a good compliment. You know to what? The I'm going to go get napkins. You guys are great, and I'll see you soon. Thank you. Thank you. So funny, her being here. She says she didn't pick the silverware. Or the ducks in the bathroom, so... The taste level for her is is un, is unclear, but this place is very tasteful. I want you to come with me on an international tour, and I want you to pick the wine and the decorations, and I want you to pick all the guests and the tableware and Every, the tankards, everything, the shots, the spirits, all of it. And I, I want you to organise all my international investment dinners. Yes. You see, I, I want you to be at my side. Yes. That, I yes. such a job I was, I was born to do. I, I will get you something that makes this silverware look ridiculous and, and flimsy. I, uh, Roger, you're such a wonderful man. Such a fun, caring, discerning, oh. thoughtful man. Let's head to the prairie, shall we? If, is it okay if, if perhaps Tina does not, uh, does not accompany us? I'm a great dancer. Oh, really? Anxiety creeps up on me Is this how it's supposed to feel? Tell me when it's over I got some place that I gotta be It won't leave My friends, hey, get out of your Thanks for joining us, everybody. And see you next time.